guys welcome back to my channel and welcome to today's video guys i haven't done one of these in a very long time a get ready with me video i used to enjoy filming videos like this but for some reason i haven't done a video like this in so long i hope you guys like my new filming space i'm still setting it up i'm still expecting like some stuff so this background is still going to change up a little bit but um this is what we're working with for now okay how you guys doing you guys are doing amazingly well welcome back to my channel if you are new here you're absolutely welcome 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 to the family and i hope you stay by subscribing okay um without further ado let's get right into this video i'm going to apply makeup today and talk to you guys at the same time so this is going to be like a chit chat get ready with me video so sit back relax and enjoy okay guys so i don't have a particular look in mind though that i'm going for today i'm just going to open my makeup drawers and just play i'm going to be using this this is the so clear instant perfection makeup primer i'm just going to take a little bit how are you guys doing like you know with everything that's been happening in the country and everything how are you guys coping how are you guys doing with like moving on and stuff not necessarily like moving on because i mean aluta continua the fight still continues but how are you guys doing with everything that's been going on going back to our regular lives and everything how are you guys doing it's unfortunate what has been going on in the country can't say that i'm surprised with everything that has been happening because i mean that's just the country that we're living it's just unfortunate that corruption has eaten neck deep into the system like it's just so unfortunate but what do we do we keep fighting let those who have died let their deaths not be in vain that's all i can say right now the foundation i'm going to be using the huda beauty foundation this is actually one of my favorite favorite foundations of all time because it has amazing coverage and it stays put you guys i have missed applying makeup on camera like why is this foundation looking ashy? I swear it's not this ashy in person. I don't know why it's looking ashy today. So as you know, we just moved into a new place and we have been settling in really, really well. Quite frankly, you guys, we settled in really, really fast. You know, faster than I thought we we're going to settle in. And that is because my help, oh my God, you guys, my help has been amazing. That lady, she has been so, 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 so amazing. She literally did most of the packing, like, while we were being lazy and everything when we we're still in the old place like for instance now like my husband for instance that, that guy did not pack one pin from that house <laughs> he did not pack one pin from that house but she's been so amazing she did most of the packing and um aside doing most of the packing she also gingered us to like unpack really early so like i remember when i moved to my previous house when i moved to my you guys this 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 foundation is looking very scary right now but i swear it's not scary i don't know what's happening she literally like gingered us to unpack like before we could even settle down you know how a lot of you were like telling me on my previous videos that unpacking is not a one day thing just take your time which i was going to take my time to unpack but <laughs> eliza did not allow me she did not allow me to rest once it is morning like auntie let's do this room let's unpack this one let's do this one so before i knew it you guys we were done unpacking like before i knew it and we've settled in really 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 nicely she has been of immense help immense like she has been of immense help i can't even lie you guys moving house is no joke like i can't begin to tell you guys the financial implication like <laughs> you guys moving house is no joke moving house is a whole lot of money okay it's a whole lot of money let's not even talk about the rent like the rent is standard yeah but like all the other expenses you know when you're moving a house you have to like uninstall all your stuff if you have acs you're going to uninstall them you uninstall your dstv you uninstall so many things and then move to the new house and reinstall them let's not even talk about the moving process you know you have to pay people you know to move your stuff for you unpack them for you and set them up and everything so yes from carpenters to painters to ac technicians name it all manners of handymen have been in and out of this house and you know it hasn't like really really 
been easy you know in terms of finances you know but yes that's why i told you guys also in my previous vlog that it's going to take a, a little while okay just bear with me it's going to take a little while before the full house tour comes and that is because um we we do have a couple of things that we still want to do in the house and we can't do all of them at once okay we can't do everything at once because <laughs> it's still a whole lot of money okay so there are still a lot of things that we want to change uh in terms of furniture and setups and everything so that will take a little bit of time anytime you guys see that new house so please just bear with me eh? it's not my fault okay you guys i miss the days like i miss the days when i was just like me yeah and i didn't have any worries in the world like your parents worried about everything adulting is a scam we were so eager to grow up we we're so eager to become adults as in we were so so eager to become adults when we were when we were little and looking back now it was almost as if where were we rushing to like where were we going what was the rush if i knew then what i know now about adulting i would have remained a child though because huh, my god you guys responsibilities eh all the way especially like when you have a child i don't even want to know how those who have more than one child are coping because when i just think of mia like the things that mia needs in a week you buy pick one two three for some reason pick one two three milk see mia takes pick one two three milk eh for some reason because she takes it like multiple times a day she takes it in the morning with her milo uses it for pap for custard and for her golden bun so we go we run through pick one two three milk a lot like a whole lot in a week you know we can buy like two refill packs of pick one two three milk and I'm just like, I didn't sign up for this, so this is not what I signed up for. Because it can just be so expensive, you guys. Let's not talk about diapers as well. I'm hoping that I get to potty train her really soon. Um, she's showing interest in potty training already. So I'm going to actually like start potty training her very, very soon. So that we can we can stop spending money on diapers. I don't know how you guys that have like kids that like multiple kids are trying and those like have kids like back to back like every other year like i really don't know how you put a copy because omo it's not easy like it's not easy at all oh by the way i'm using this um setting powder from flawless ivy uh it's the the banana shade i think no the topaz shade i really like this stuff i'm going to use my maybelline fit me to just take off all of the excess powder and then set the rest of my face. Let's have a good time. Baby, I'm a baby. One thing I believe in is that guys, please don't have kids that you cannot take care of. Hey, <laughs> hey. Like, don't do it to yourself. No matter what anybody else is saying, don't have kids that you cannot take care of because that's uh, what's it called now? That's um thinking. That's Thing that people do that they say oh just have the kids go to take care of the kids and all that i'm just like <laughs> i'm not gonna have any kids that i can't take care of okay i'm not gonna have any kids that i cannot give the kind of life i want to give them you guys you guys feel me uh -huh. i'm not gonna do that to save time i'm just going to do my brows off camera just so that we don't sleep here today i'm going to do my brows off camera and i'll be right back so yeah brows are done i use the bingwa beauty uh, pencil being one lux brow pencil this is what it looks like i love this thing okay so for my eyeshadow today i'm just going to be playing with the flawless ivy damn girl damn girl eyeshadow palette and this is what it looks like it just has a lot of um neutral shades i really haven't been feeling my best in terms of um what is it called now in terms of like you know my health you guys with the, whole, with the whole moving process and everything i haven't done any form of exercise in in literally like two weeks should be up for two weeks now yeah in about two weeks i haven't like done any exercise i wake up in the morning tired like i can't be bothered <laughs> and i really miss at least my my jump ropes my skipping i really miss that and i don't know why even with the moving process i'm supposed to like be stressed out and everything but for some reason i feel like i gained a bit of weight during this moving process like i don't know why maybe i was just eating whatever i liked because i was just always stressed and always tired and hungry 
so i feel like i probably ate what i shouldn't be eating it's showing on my body i feel like i've added a bit of weight you guys and it's not even funny you guys eh postpartum life eh it never ends though. my child is 19 months literally she'll be 19 months um in about two days and i'm still battling with my postpartum body ah <sighs> it's not funny like there are sometimes i just look at, look at myself in the mirror and i'm just like god can i just go back to the way i was even before i got married i was it's not like i was it's not like i was that slim but at least i wasn't this big <laughs> so sometimes i just say to myself sometimes i wish i can just go back to like being the way i was like seven eight years ago maybe like when i was in my single years and everything these days i'm just so conscious every angle doesn't look good to me every angle has rolls every angle has fats every angle has all of that i haven't even been using my waist trainer judiciously like i only use it when i want to like work out right now i'm wearing it though i pray for the day that i will not have to use waist trainer like will my tummy ever get back to that i'm so conscious of my belly these days guys like hey I know my stomach is big oh it's big it's very big like and some people are even telling me ah you've not even had the second one by the time you have the second one now ah somebody told me that by the time i have the second one i'm going to be bigger than this and i'm like back to sender oh back to sender anything bigger than this is not allowed please eh thank you very much yeah guys i've been battling with my postpartum body i won't even lie to you you know all these secret battles you have like people around you might not know that you have these battles or you're having these personal battles you know self-confidence your body and everything is something that you battle alone behind closed doors so i feel like that's one thing i'm really battling you know i don't come out to say it much but i feel like that's one thing i'm battling some people will now come and tell me in the comments now have you looked at yourself you are beautiful the way you are you are fine you are this you are that but man the struggle is real though. i'm going to line my eyes with the maybelline colossal kajal this is one of my favorites if not my favorite eyeliner of all time because it's so black can you guys see how black that eyeliner is it's beautiful this is the maybelline colossal go extreme mascara just going to use that to like bring out those lashes a little bit i'm going to use my blush to contour but i'm not ready to start going through that extra step right now try using your blush to contour especially if your blush is dark enough try using your blush to contour and see if it's something that you like but for me i like the way my face looks and i use my blush to contour i'm going to highlight with the maybelline master chrome metallic highlighter you guys are eh, back to think what has been happening in nigeria and eh? do you know that at some point i had to log out like i had to log out of instagram for my own sanity like ah, especially that day that the day of the lekki massacre like i remember very 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 well the day of that massacre like my head became so heavy from all the violence and bloodshed i was seeing on the internet i had to log out of that space you guys it wasn't healthy like it wasn't healthy i logged out for like that night and the following day like the major part of the following day because it was just too much you guys a lot of people have been battling with their mental health you guys in the last couple of days in the last week a lot of people have been battling with their mental health like it's so crazy it is so crazy and i really hope that many of you like lost just logged off twitter or instagram if it became too much for you because see last last day your mental health is cute what i need now if you ask me alma what is that one thing you need right now i want to just travel i just want to just travel for like one month one whole month then come back location of my dreams any nice island somewhere that's what i feel like doing right now like legit that's what i feel like doing ah before i forget thank you guys so much for all the love on my channel recently like ever since my house tour video i've gotten a couple more subscribers the channel is growing you, know, you guys like like joke like joke we are growing you know. please keep subscribing keep watching keep commenting keep thumbsing up keep doing all that stuff keep subscribing please keep showing me love i love that you guys love my content and even though it's not easy waking up in the morning thinking of what to film what to vlog and all of that it's not easy but we are still pushing okay and the only way you guys can keep motivating me is by subscribing okay by watching and subscribing leaving your comments let me know that you guys enjoyed the video and all of that that keeps me going 
and keeps me motivated okay i think we're done with the eyes so for my lips i'm just going to go uh nude i think i'm not ready for any color today this is a classic makeup um this is a classic lipstick but i really like it because it has a very nice peachy uh tone to it so i really like it i think we have come to the end of this video but first i'm going to show you guys my outfits or rather my top in this case because the top is the center of this look right now so that is it for this video hope you guys enjoyed watching if you enjoyed watching please do not forget to subscribe if you are not yet subscribed already be sure to give the video a thumbs up if you enjoyed watching leave me a comment down below do i look fly do i look pretty do i look beautiful let me know in the comment section below and also share 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 with as many people as you can and i'll see you guys in my next video Mwah. bye